Oke okay, kelas. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. How are you for this time? I hope that you're okay. For this session here, we are going to focus for the listening comprehension. Yeah. Uh, so this session, uh, of course, uh, that would be focusing for your ability to listen well, especially for the TOEFL one. Yeah. And in the TOEFL for the listening, there are part A, part B, and also part C. And we start starting from part A. There are several general strategies, strategies yeah, that you can face. This is number one, two, three, until five. The first is uh, be familiar with the direction. So make sure when you are going to start your listening here, so you are in a familiar, especially for the direction or the direction. And then listen carefully to the conversation and talk there. Concentrate fully yeah, on what speakers are saying, recording, because you will hear the recording one time only. The recording cannot be repeated yeah, for your test letter. So make it happy. You start there. Yeah. Make it happy. You start uh, your own uh, listening or your practicing, uh, trying once. Yeah. Number two. Uh, know where the easier and more difficult are generally found. Yeah. So generally progress from easy to difficult. For example, number one to 15. So of course, number uh, 15 is uh, more difficult. Yeah. From easy to difficult. Ever leave any questions blank on your answer sheet? And fourth one, do not ever laugh. Yeah, any answers is unblank answers means like you never uh, answers on it. No, but because of there is no penalty, yeah, you may guess. Yeah, you may guess. Uh, use any remaining time to look ahead to answer the questions that below. When you finish with the one question, yeah, you may have time to look ahead. Means like you may uh, look ahead the answers to the questions that below. Okay, uh, continue this one, part A. Yeah. This is part A for the listening. In part A, you are focusing for the listening comprehension section. Yeah, test. And remember, you are going to listen between two speakers followed by questions. Yeah. Two speakers and then followed by the question. For example, on the recording you hear, yeah, I need a car. Yeah. I need a car to drive to Arizona and I don't have one. Why not rent one? And then uh, there will be question, what does the woman suggest? In your textbook, you read, yeah. Uh, so uh, the options, getting a red car, renting an apartment in Arizona, not driving to Arizona, and renting a car for uh, the trip. So why, why not rent one? So because this is suggestion, right? So uh, uh, the best answer is Delta, yeah? And now, uh, this is strategy yeah, for listening part A question. As you listen, as it's short conversation, yeah, focus on the second one. Yeah, first focus. On this is one. Why not rent one? This is your focus here, selector, yeah. And then uh, keep in mind the correct answer is probably restatement. The correct answer probably is statement. A keywords or idea in second line. Think possible statement. Don't think the same sound. Number three, uh, keep in mind uh, for the part A, yeah, uh, you are going to test it regularly after the statement. There will be negative, suggestion, passive, conclusion, we were, and expression agreement. So uh, you are going to be guided yeah, uh, this test, especially there will be restatement, negative, suggestion, passive. And on. So will be repeated again and again. Or keep in mind that the question generally progress from easy to difficult. One to 30 question that you are going to face for uh, dialogues yeah, and then followed by questions, yeah, a short dialogues. So one to 30. So one to five easy, 26 to 30, that would be the hardest ones. Now, number five. Uh, read the answers and choose the best answer to each question. Or, yeah, to answer each question, even if you are not sure of the correct response, leave any answers blank. Never leave any answers blank, even if you... No, and number six, this is the important one, even if you do not understand the conversation, yeah, even though you get difficulties, yeah, you can find the correct answer. How? The first. If you only understood few words are there in second line, choose the answers that contain the statement. Yeah. 
spontaneous statement, not the same sound. If you don't understand anything at all in the second line at the conversation, just answer that sounds the most different. Remember, the sound most different, not the same sound, yeah. And then never choose any answer because it sounds like. Kalau suaranya sama atau mirip, do not ever choose it, right? Now let's go to the skill one. Yeah, you are going to face for the dialogue and followed by question. There are six uh, skill. Now let's focusing for the skill one, three statement. On the correct answer in listening part A, yeah, content three statement. You can find this one. Thief is a, is something the matter? You didn't look very good. Oh, I'm feeling little sick today. Little sick today. What does the man mean? Little sick. We do not find the similar sound. We do not find uh, the, the the sound that is same, say, but the focus eh, for the restatement. Restatement from little sick, it is a bit ill. Kita nggak cari yang good looking, ada kata look, look, ya. Eh. Look, gitu. And then feels, feels, right? But we try to find the restatement for the correct answer one. Okay, now let's go to this one. You were the best strategy to choose the answer of the statement. As you listen to the second line of the conversation, you should focus on the key ideas in that line. The statement of the key ideas in particular answers, then you have probably found the correct answers. Do not choose answers with the words that sound similar to the words on the. Get it right? Restatement. The keyword is restatement. So now let's find this exercise here. What do you like about your new house? What do you like about your new house? It's very close to the park. What does the man mean? Katanya adalah it's very close to the park. So the one here, the house is close up now. No, the park is in it, but the, his home is near a park. Close to the park, same as near the park. So the right answer is early. Yeah. Okay, let's go to number two. Mark said some really nice things to me. He's very grateful for what you did. What does the woman say about Mark? He did a great job. He bought grateful. This will sound right. Great job, grateful. Then almost sure, yeah. he met a, a grateful of himself. He's thankful. Now find the different sounds. Yeah. Uh, he's thankful. So the correct one is he is thankful. This statement, remember, this statement. Uh, number three. Sam, you've been working eh, at the computer for hours. Yes, and I need to take a break. What does the man mean? Take a break, right? The computer's broken. He needs to relax for a while. Should keep working. So the correct one, he needs to relax for a while. Yes, I need to take a break. And break broke, yeah. Keep working, ada kata working, computer, second, broke, broke, yeah. break, yeah. Gak jauh -jauh bunyinya, broken, nama broke. So the right one it is. Okay, now let's go for the listening, yeah. Tofel exercise one. Uh, you are going to listen for this listening here from one to ten. And remember, you may take note your answers and then you can share, yeah, in the virtual meeting with me. Okay, you may start now. One, two, three, go. TOEFL Exercise 1, page 30. In this exercise, listen carefully to the short dialogue and question on the recording, and then choose the best answer to the question. You should look for restatements of key ideas in the last line. Number 1. How was the dance last night? We had such a good time. What does the woman mean? Number two. Are you ready to leave? I need about 30 minutes. What does the woman mean? Number three. I'm really having trouble in psychology class. You should talk with the teacher. What does the man mean? Number four. 
Have you found a job yet? I actually started my new job yesterday. What does the woman mean? Number five. Do you know why Stan wanted to talk to me? He needs to find someone to share an apartment. What does the woman say about Stan? Number six. When are you taking your vacation? In the fall. What does the man mean? Number seven. Did you enjoy the book? It was quite pleasant to read. What does the woman mean? Number eight. Why were you so late? Traffic was very heavy. What does the man mean? Number nine. Do you want to go to the game with us tonight? Sorry, I can't. I have to finish the report for history class. What does the man mean? Number 10. Does Steve work for you? No, Steve manages his own business. What does the woman say about Steve? Okay, class, uh, after you have heard uh, 10 listenings related about uh, skill one, so you can get the right answer. Okay? But we can share and discuss on the virtual meeting. Thank you very much. Uh, let's go to the skill uh, two. Yeah. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.